हेलो फ्रेंड्स दिस इज योर फ्रेंड मैनाक फ्रॉम सिविल सेंटर एंड आई वेलकम ऑल ऑफ यू बैक टू आवर वीडियो ट्यूटोरियल सीरीज ऑन ऑटो कैट सो फ्रेंड्स इन द प्रीवियस वीडियो वी हैड डिस्कस्ड अबाउट दिस प्लान व्हिच वी आर गोइंग टू ड्राफ्ट इन ऑटो कैट सो विदाउट वेस्टिंग एनी टाइम लेट्स गेट स्टार्टेड सो दिस इज आवर इंटरफेस ऑफ ऑटो कैट फॉर स्टार्टिंग ए न्यू ड्राइंग वी जस्ट हैव टू क्लिक ऑन दिस स्टार्ट ड्राइंग सो एज यू कैन सी Our interface has opened a new file. For closing the grid, we can press F7 because we don't want this grid lines. So first of all, I want to set my units. For that, simply I can press U and enter. And then the unit type as we saw that our plan was in feet and inches, we can do this as architectural and precision we can select this 0 ft 0 inches and insertion scale will be ft now we won't press this we'll simply press okay here for use with architectural or engineering linear units insert units should be set to inches so we are sure that we want to update this so we'll click on okay next thing we want to do is we'll go to annotate so there are two settings here text and dimensions which we'll do so first of all we'll click on this arrow here text style after that we can select the standard option and in the standard option we'll change the font size to times new roman we can select times new roman here and the text height we can give as 10 inches so 10 inches will be our text height and then we'll simply click on set parent yes so the text height has been changed so we'll simply close this now the next thing we want to do is we want to set our dimensions for that we'll click on this arrow dimension dimension style after that we'll go to standard and then modify so after that we'll go to our symbols and arrows so our arrow size we can keep the same as our text size that is 10 inches after that we'll go to our text in our text as you can see that already it has been set to standard because we had set our text earlier so it is set by default so we can keep this and for the text alignment we want to do as iso standard after that we can set our primary units in our primary units we'll go and change this unit format to architectural precision we'll give the same as we had gave as we had given in our unit settings then we'll go to our fit in the fit you can see there there is an option of fit options so we'll keep this as default for the text placement we can give this select this option over dimension line without leader when text is not in the default position we can place it over dimension line without leader now the scale will keep as default for now we'll simply press okay set current close so friends the settings of my units text and dimensions have been done now we can save the file so we'll save the file here control plus s and save the file in our desktop drawing 3 you can write here first floor plan and then save this file so we'll save the file and start our drawings in the next video so if you found this video useful please hit the like button and if you haven't subscribed to our channel yet do subscribe because we'll keep bringing more such videos bye bye